Hello everyone. Today I am going to show how to build an image classification model, based on deep learning neural networks using the machine learning packages, like Keras and TensorFlow. I will be using Spider IDE as platform from Python 3.6 to build the deep learning models. So let us first start with the basic introduction on what is deep learning. In order to build a deep learning model for image classification, I am using important tools like Spider IDE from Python 3.6 64-bit version as per my system requirements, then the Keras 2.0 package, which is used to call all the library functions to build the neural networks, for the given data and finally you can also use TensorFlow package individually, for fast processing and computation of the huge data. Even Keras also utilizes TensorFlow in the backend for fast processing of data, but TensorFlow package is much faster than the Keras 2.0. Today I will be showing you how to build the deep learning model using Keras for image classification. So the scenario is, I have considered the different breeds of dogs and cats to perform image classification, so that the model which we will build has the capability to classify these images into two different classes, and predicts the correct image by comparing with the testing image and gives its identification details to the user. So the problem statement is to build such a model which can classify two different classes and gives the right prediction by using deep learning neural networks. In order to do that, we need to build a supervised learning model when you are playing with the classification problems. After building the model, it should have the capability to predict the right image, with respect to the input data provided to the model and identify its characteristics or features as per your requirement. So, I have downloaded few images from the Google as you can see different breeds of cats are displayed through which I have extracted 4,000 images for training set and 1,000 images for the testing set. You can also see different breeds of dogs with their images where I have extracted 4,000 images for training set and 1,000 images for testing set. Since the model we are building is the supervised learning model, I have stored these images in separate folders for training and testing data and split those images in two different folders for images of cats and dogs, so the model fetch the data as per the training and test set individually. Now, run the code and you will see for every epoch, the model is gaining accuracy of the performance and gaining the capacity to predict the right images. So you can see the training accuracy as 68% and the testing accuracy as 71%. The accuracy can be improved by adjusting the epoch levels and batch size levels of the data that is provided to the model. The epoch levels has to be considered with respect the population and sample data that has been utilized in the model. Now, I am going to load the model I have built by importing required libraries that are needed to perform this operation. Then model will be compiled and optimized for the effective accuracies when the new image data is provided to the model. Now, I am taking a cat image from the test data as shown in File Explorer in rightmost top corner. I am going to import this image in in the Python and you can view the image in the console. This image is converted into arrays with four dimensions and call the image in the predict model function where the image is analyzed with respect to the train model and identify the image features and characteristics and predicts to which family it belongs, either cat or dog. As you can see the image is belong to the cat family. Now the same is done for the dog image which is taken from the test data and image is called into the model to perform prediction and you can see the dog image when it is imported. As the model predicts the image, you can see in the console, the model belongs to the dog family. Now in order to validate the model, let us take the new image data from a random location either it could be from local driver or web server. Here I have taken a random image from local drive which is a dog image as shown. Now let us import this image in the model and perform prediction on the image data. Finally you can see the model predicts that the new data image provided belongs to the dog family. This is how the image classification is performed by building the deep learning model which will identify the image based on the model performance by identifying the image features and its characteristics if required. 
That's all for this video, for any queries please reach us at vj.ready at